Okay, so here's our quiz problem. What we're going to be doing is adding these two fractions here. So if you haven't tried the problem, maybe you want to go and pause the video and see if you can do it now. All right, let's take a look at the solution. So the first thing about adding and subtracting fractions is we need to have the denominators be the same. And in this case, they're not the same. So what we have to do is find the LCD. So this is a real critical skill um, when we're talking about fractions. So definitely make sure that you know how to find the LCD. In this case, LCD, the lowest common denominator, is 15. All right, and just a quick review of what that number uh, means, or one way you can kind of think of that number, it's the lowest number that both these two numbers can divide into. Okay, so if you're thinking about five and three, saying, well, what's the lowest number that both of those numbers can divide into? It's 15. Of course, finding the LC is a whole other topic in and of itself. So just make sure you know how to find the LCD when you're adding and subtracting fractions. All right, so now that we have the LCD, what you have to do is rewrite the fractions such that they have uh, the LCD as their denominator. Okay, so you can see down here, these fractions now, okay, have been rewritten with uh, the LCD as a denominator, and of course the denominators are the same. And the way you do that, if you recall, is we have to look at our current denominators, use a different color over here, we have to ask ourselves, what number would I have to multiply my current denominator by to get to that LCD? So if I have 5 as my denominator, and I want to make that into 15, I would have to multiply it by 3. But if you multiply the bottom by 3, the denominator by 3, you also have to multiply the numerator, numerator by 3. Okay, And of course, uh, that will change the fraction such that it has the new denominator being 15, and that's what we want. Okay, So you do the same thing here. We have the fraction 1 third. We want to have that uh, fraction have 15, have 15 as its denominator. So we're going to multiply by 5, but we also have to multiply the numerator by 5. So there you go. Okay, So now we have the new fraction. Uh, or the new problem, 6 over 15 plus 5 over 15. And then, of course, when you have fractions that have the same denominator, all you have to do is add the numerator. So we have 6 plus 15, that, of course, is 11, and we have our same denominator, 15, 11 fifteenths. Okay, so adding and subtracting fractions, big, uh, important topic. Uh, not overly complex. I would, I think, probably the toughest part um, about the... Uh, fraction problems for students is one, uh, finding the LCD, and then two, rewriting the fractions such that it has LCD. But if you can get those two things down, you should be able to uh, do, do all these uh, different fraction problems. And of course, if you're a homeschooler and you want to take more of these pop quizzes, please jump on over to homeschoolmathquiz.com. Hope to see you there. Have a great day.